Hey guys, it's Marco again. Nightmare Incursion Farm has seen some changes. Report and Gather quests are dropped to only 60 silver each. But kill quests were buffed to 7 gold. Boss kills and escorts remained on the same gold level. So what does this mean for overall gold farm? To begin with, your run times will take a bit longer to do, because now you actually want to do the kill quests before turning in. This means that you can't mindlessly AFK farm this like you used to, so I would say that it's a nice change. In my first hour of running this farm, 1 hour and 5 minutes to be specific, I managed to get 113 gold. This means that the farm will still yield more than 100 gold per hour, especially if you do it in coordinated group. I did this run with random players. I didn't do the turtle killing quest, since you need to kill 20 of them and they're too far spread. It might be worth killing them if you have a skinner on your team, since they will drop a lot of star shells when skinned and the skinner can distribute them inside of the group. You can see my full run in the background and it's important to note that there is a lot of moonkins around the cave in hinterlands, so if there are none in the cave, go outside, you can also split your party. This time around, you want to find layers with less players to have a better gold per hour. Also, it's more important now to find the escorts, since you're already spending more time inside of the nightmare. I haven't tried Feralas farm, but I can't be a good judge for that farm, since it's heavily whore dominated on my server. But take the same principle there, it's worth doing kill quests. With that said, I still think that this is the best gold farm at the moment, even though its gold per hour has been nerfed slightly. So good luck farming and remember the rule, exploit often and exploit early. Thank you for watching and bye bye.